we're going to take a look at linking a Google Doc into your calendar. That way, at any given time, a student could be on their calendar, click a link, and get the Google Doc for their instructions on what they should be doing in class, their homework, a collaborative document, something along those lines. I have a sample here. It's just called Test 2. If I click, as a student, I would click once, I could see some information. But if I go to More Details, this is where, under Description, you can put a link to your Google Doc, but also some directions. So as a student, I would just click this link, and it opens up the Google Doc so I can begin editing. The teacher can make the document either editable, so the students can go in there and write, or just a read-only. In other words, they pull the document up, they can see what's there, but they cannot edit anything. So how do we do that? So I need to first start with a Google Doc. So I've opened up my Google Doc here and I need to title it. So here's the name of my document. I'm going to click OK to set it up here. And then, so here we go. I write some directions, something along those lines. I put information here that the students are going to need. In the upper right hand corner, I click Share. I want to change who has access to this. So anyone with a link, anyone can view. At this point, I could change it to anybody could edit or comment, but I just want my students to view it. Click Save, and it's going to give me this link. If I copy the link, go back to my calendar. Now in the calendar, I want to say it's going to be Friday at noon. I want this to appear. I'm just going to call it my unit study guide. Put it on Mr. D's calendar. This is where I need to go into edit the event. Under the description. Then I paste the link. Go ahead and click save. The students will see this on your calendar. So all they're going to have to do is click. I'm going to use this as the example and then choose more details. When they choose more details, it'll come up with the notes that I've given them and then the document link.